You're watching WMAR 2 News. The state health department has started to update statistics on the coronavirus once again after a network outage that's been going on since last week. Good afternoon, Maryland. I'm Christian Schaefer. The numbers typically come out every day at 10 in the morning. Today is the first day that any of them have changed since Friday. The number that's been updated is the number of people hospitalized with serious cases of the coronavirus. It is now 925 people. That is up significantly from Friday's report. At that time, there were 767 people hospitalized. The other numbers, including the number of people who've died from COVID-19 since Friday and the state's positivity rate have still not been updated because apparently of that network outage. A trial date has been set for the mayor on the Eastern Shore accused of posting revenge porn. The trial of Andrew Bradshaw is set to start on April the 26th. He's the mayor of Cambridge. Investigators say he posted graphic photos of his ex-girlfriend on social media without the woman's consent. Documents filed in support of the charges indicate that the post included cap with racial slurs and sexually explicit language. Bradshaw has not stepped down from his position as the mayor of Cambridge, but he is on an indefinite unpaid leave of absence. And now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Happy Wednesday, Maryland. We woke up to some flurries out there today for a lot of us and even dealt with some Virga, so it evaporated before it hit the surface. Uh, but this afternoon, we are looking a lot drier with plenty of clouds. It's going to take us through the day. Temperatures only rise into the upper 30s and the lower 40s outside. Winds are going to be pretty light in nature, eventually veering out of the west around 5 to 10 miles per hour. But we are going to be talking about clearing skies aloft, uh, so that's going to allow for pretty strong radiational cooling to take place. So a lot of us are going to be dropping off into the mid and upper 20s as we wake up tomorrow morning. Burr is going to be the weather word for tomorrow morning. You want the warm hat and you want the gloves with you before heading out and about. Staying below normal as we head into your Thursday afternoon, only topping out around 45 degrees. Clouds are going to be pretty prevalent as we head into your Friday as we wrap up the work week with temperatures rising into the lower 50s. Heading into the start of the upcoming weekend, well above average, 71 degrees. So yes, it's going to be feeling warm, but it comes with a catch. We could be talking about some showers, even a few rumbles of thunder later on in the day. Slight chance for showers and much cooler into your Sunday. Meteorologist Stevie Daniels, thanks very much and stay with us online at WMARTnews.com all day long for updates on top stories and breaking news and for news and weather on the go. You can download the WMAR2 News app from the App Store or follow us on social media at WMAR2 News. Thanks for watching. I'm Christian Schaefer. This WMAR2 News update is sponsored by Jones Junction.